Okay, so uh, here we are at the boiler feed pump. Um, we've uh, cleaned back some monitoring locations where we're going to uh, fit some monitoring discs. So we've chosen the key locations at which we're going to take our routine measurements. And to ensure data repeatability, it's important that we get those locations clearly marked so we take them at the same place every time we take our measurements. So we're just going to put a monitoring disc on now. Um, we've got some uh, structural adhesive, some liquid metal is a good um, practice to use. The surface is clean, just applying some activator to the surface and uh, the same to our monitoring disc. Just let that dry off for a few seconds. And then we get our structural adhesive um, that uh, we're going to apply to the monitoring disc. So a small, uh, a small pool of uh, structural adhesive. It's important that we use the correct type of adhesive to ensure we don't dampen the signal to any great degree. Because obviously it's important we see high frequency data in our signal and we don't want to dampen that away. So I've just applied some uh, adhesive to the monitoring disc and I'm going to put that onto the monitoring location. Okay, so having applied our structural adhesive to the disc and placed it on the machine, I'll hold it for a few seconds just to get it support and then that should adhere to the machine quite nicely and we'll allow that to set for a few minutes and we'll be able to come back later on and take our routine measurements. Again, it's very important the surface is cleaned back. We go back to bare metal. We use the right adhesive to get the transmission path through to the sensor location. Same place, same location, every time. Great repeatability.